Hi there guys, Kawa here. So welcome to 2019. Uh, the season for Arena just started. And um, seeing as this is going to be the last day of my vacation, I'm going to do this Arena run for you guys. Um, I'm running this team for now. Uh, you already s could see that I got two wins here already. Uh, I was just more or less testing out the team before I actually ran with it. Uh, I previously did run into a uh, Sage of Six Path Naruto. Uh, I didn't record it, obviously, because I was still testing the team. It was a really close fight, but I won on the grounds that uh, he did not get a reset on that final round, and I was able to hit him with the shark. Um, but yeah, ignoring that point. Um, so yeah, I'm going to start queuing, and I'll just start talking about the team right now. So this team is a team that I would never suggest anyone to run in Arena, because it's a Chaos Water team, and your Chaos rates in uh, the Arena is pretty low. But uh, if you do feel the need to run something like this, you absolutely have to take the uh, ch the, the dissecting blade chase, where she, you know she does the knockdown to high float uh, because it has a hundred percent crit rate, so you guarantee get a chaos out of it. But more or less, this team is just my idea of what do you define as too much poison. Oh, uh, interesting. Let's see. Okay, we're gonna want to try to kill. Yeah, pretty quick. Alright, you know what? I don't know what this Earth Me has, so I'm just gonna put him to sleep. I feel like he wanted to do Itachi into double attack, so I'm just gonna get it out of the way. Uh, okay. Oh, I, I've. Yes. I completely forgot. I'm supposed to use the um, attack on Naruto because I have the 100% uh, crit rate. I could interrupt his um, mystery. But whatever. Our objective right now is to kill off the two back row units who are not immune because we're just going to stack poison on top of them. They should die relatively quick because um, Hanzo and uh, Karin's poison are two totally different types of poison. And also because he doesn't have a separate debuff that he can use uh, prior to Naruto's CC chase, um, the CC will always reflect it. This Madara is not long for this world. He's going to die probably next round. Oh, he got a chaos off on me. Okay. Yeah, see? Madara just died. So it was a double attack. I was correct. Right. Let me get her out of that. Yes. I think we're fine still, because he didn't gain any chakra out of that um, trade-off, because there was no Madara there. Uh, it's quite painful though, but I don't think we're in danger yet. Just Itachi should die to the next shark. Because the uh, his resistance is relatively low by now. Sadly, the poison doesn't affect them, but um, it's extra damage, so it helps. Yeah, this Itachi is totally dead. He's probably gonna be able to kill my water main, but I think the other three with their standard attack should be able to get there. Well, let's see. Always, it's always going to reflect that back at him. Alright, we're just going to tag him with that and do like 2,000 damage for no reason. So as you can clearly see, he's taking a lot of damage right now because uh, Gamariki is just like shredding him. If the tree hits him, he might die. Oh, he lives barely. Okay. Alright. So, yeah guys, you could see that being immune does not mean anything in here. Uh, if you have Gamariki, which shreds the resistance, it makes a big difference. But I did make a misplay in the beginning. Um, his first initial mystery should never have went off, because I was supposed to interrupt him. So we're going to just keep going with this team until we start running into trouble. Uh, 
something like this might bring us into trouble. Okay, so a mirror already was used. So I think we're gonna put her to sleep. Oh, so also wanted us to say, um, this was not part of my planning, but um, I completely forgot uh, that uh, Karin here, when she comes with the fight start, she lowers males' um, resistance, I think it was. And that would trigger a mirror. So... It's really nice, because if I tr burn someone's mirror, then Itachi can just, you know, go ahead and sleep them. Alright, this one's a little tricky because there's a clone, so I can't 100% be confident it will... The frog will tag Minato. So, let's find out. Um, it's a relatively low chance I'm gonna miss, but you never know, right? Okay. Got him. So this is also a reason why I like to use the frog. It's reusable. Uh, it doesn't matter as much in the arena, but yeah. Uh, a reset? Okay. So yeah, we're gonna eat that Rasengan. But thank you for my shark mom stealing his chakra. That current knight was not allowed to wake up. Ugh, this damn clone in my way. So this is gonna be a little bit troubling. I think my water main's dead. Yeah, she's dead. Um, it, it's troubling in the sense that it she had dance impetus. I probably should have should I have slept her. Yeah, I probably should have slept her. I. I shouldn't have slept the current eye because current eye was not going to get enough chakra at any point to um, release the water main. I mean the wind main. Yeah, it was a mistake on my behalf. I should have just slept the wind main. Yeah, definitely should have just slept the wind main. But yeah, I I don't know. It's it, it's a thing. I don't I don't like seeing Shisui's inside the arena because he's one of like the most ridiculous units in the arena but he is not g that great outside the arena he like I, I know a lot of people don't like to hear that but it's the truth he's not really that great outside the arena he's really squishy his dodge isn't really not factor okay um okay. i'm just gonna go ahead yet again put you to sleep Alright, this time we're not gonna mess up. So, we didn't get Hanzo's poison here, but I think we're good. Alright, we got some more tree poison going on. Look at that poison damage! <laughs> ah, that poison damage is so ridiculous. And that's not counting Hanzo. If Hanzo did it too, he would have died. So from what I can tell, this Madara is not long for the world either. Uh, this poison is so ridiculous. Uh, what is this? Whoa, friend. Alright, if anything, your mirror is ready. Oh no, got it off? Oh, Kasami got me. Oh, okay. I was supposed to say, what? What happened? Uh, and they're faster than me. They're faster than me, and they have a Madara. Who could this be? Uh, is this placeholder? It might be placeholder. I don't know. We're not going to waste our time, because... Um, that's a Ten Tails Madara, and um, I don't think we're gonna be able to beat him with a fun team like this. <laughs> we, pro I don't know. I don't want to say we probably could. We had a chance if I was able to sleep the Kisame, and then let's see what happens. Then, then he was Shark. No, then he would Mystery. It would. No, uh, yeah, I would lose because um, the Madara has a. Uh, let's stop you. Because the. Uh, Madara has the uh, immobile chase. He has two of them. Yeah. So even if I reflect Naruto's ones back at him, it's not enough to get there. 
Uh, this team is interesting. There's a move for Conan. I don't know what she's doing there, but I don't know. But whatever. So yeah, this is giving us issue again. Stupid clone. Um, this this guy's dead. Oh, so that fixes the problem. If as long as one unit dies, then the, the, the shark, you know, with the frog can't miss. So, <laughs> I just want to say this poison is so ridiculous. <laughs> it's because they stack separately on top of each other, and then the other one does like a little more. <laughs> you're, you're losing whole life bars <laughs> in one turn. There was only two, there was what, three stacks of poison? Because it was one from her chase, one from the tree, and then one from Hanzo. <laughs> and they just like dropped dead. Uh, okay, this is relatively simple. Um... This is 100% obviously she's so team, so we're going to force out. Actually, I don't think we could. Can we? Yeah, we could. We could. If the if the chase is a line, we force his dodge out. Okay. Uh. Let's just make sure he doesn't have calm mind. Okay, he doesn't have calm mind. So we can put him to sleep. Uh, her tree is gonna die, but it's not that big of a deal. But we definitely have to make sure we kill this Itachi here. So being immune to my poison is um, a very handy thing to have, I guess. I really wish I had the frags to finish up this Hanzo. Um, I think I'm missing like 37 frags to get that uh, chase. That chase buff book, where he does um, he removes your immunity for a turn. Uh, but it it just costs too much. Oh wow, he didn't dodge it really. Uh, whatever. He's still asleep for a turn, and I'm 90% sure. Yeah, 90% sure that you know his root was gone. So we should be able to get there now because the the poison should get us there now. But yeah, I wish I had that chase, but I know it was in the Konoha outlets this week, but it was like 3,000 coupons total to buy it and. I just really didn't want to pay 3,000 coupons for it. Yes, I also know that he shows up in um, the scroll system later on. Uh, I think it's the Edo Tensei scroll, so it's the next one. Um, whenever he shows up for us, obviously. I'll probably pick up his frags there. And, and you know, we occasionally get this, uh, a few of them in the survival trial, so I don't really want to pay 3,000 coupons for it if I can avoid it. But it'll be really nice in that situation because it'll be like, ha, <laughs> suppress your um, immunity. Because, you know, a lot of people are running uh, immune units these days. Which obviously makes Kagi Summit Madara really good, and um, Edo Itachi even better because you know he can just sleep right through your immunity. Well, he sleeps through anyone's buff immunity, not passive immunity. But Hanzo is a great way to beat this um, Naruto, um, just simply because um, if you're able to you know catch him with that chase, he loses his immunity for a turn. Oh hey, it's Ashura! Oh wait, the wrong chat. Usually run into him in the, uh, the bond fights. Oh, 
Oh, I messed up again. Oh well. Yes. Yeah, I totally messed that up. That was my bad. <laughs> uh, a little bit too busy typing, not enough paying attention. But this Madara should be not long for this world yet again. Alright, so does he ha have it? If he doesn't have it, I'm gonna free my whatever. I mean. Oh, I guess he thought she was lower life by accident. Oh, whatever. Hanzo will free him. Free her. Um, we're just gonna do this because there's something better to do. Yeah, I completely messed that up. <laughs> but, whatever. I don't think Itachi should be low for this world. Oh, wow, he lived by three? Uh, I think we're fine still. We can... Let's see what happens here first, though. And then I'll decide my course of action. Okay, still alive. Still alive. Alright, let's just start chipping away at his life. Might as well force the dodge while we have it. So now it's a battle between his lifesteal versus my standard attacks. Uh, because, you know, what if he's dead? <laughs> let's see what happens. Alright, let's summon another tree. Oh, 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 we're getting it, we're getting it. Come on. Hanzo, I believe in you. 200? Tree? Tree? <laughs> also, summoning that tree at that point was the idea is that, you know, Kyrene will heal someone, and hopefully the tree takes a hit for us too. So it was like kind of a double defense idea. Not sure they make a big difference, but you know, in an actual important battle, every you know inch counts. So just gotta take advantage of everything you can get. I really find this scene kind of fun. I really wish I no, actually I don't really wish it. Like, like I it's not that I really wish I bought those frags. It's I really wish I had the Hanzo skill book. <laughs> I, I don't even want. I don't even care about his, you know, mystery one. I don't care about his double cleanse. I only want the one where he uh, suppresses immunity. We really need more access to those type of um, skills because it helps again a lot against you know Naruto and stuff like that. Because right now we don't even have much of those like floating around. Right, let's handle you first. Yeah, like, we don't have enough of them. Like, we have, what, Kushina? We have, uh, Hanzo, but Hanzo's one's not readily accessible to everybody. Uh, even I don't have it. Um, I think young Jiraiya has it too, but no one plays him. And it's on his mystery, of all things. Y you need it kind of on his chase or something accessible. Alright, we just need this Shiso to dodge, come on. Be a good Shiso and dodge. There we go. <laughs> I still
still can't ever get over her stupid giggle. It's like, hee hee hee. Oh, it's just so creepy. <sighs> Alright, let's... Let's try to get these people dead. matter where it gets reflected, he's immune. Oh wait, no! It got reflected onto Shisor, he's not immune. I completely forgot about that. There was only two targets who were not immune, which was the dog and Shisor. And it hit the perfect target, I guess. Alright, still asleep. Ooh. That, that really hurt. <laughs> Alright, cast a tree. So Itachi's really good for this scenario when you run into these people who love to blitz you in the arena. I personally hate seeing that type of team, but Itachi makes it really nice for me, seeing that you know I can just take one out, not have to worry about root getting in my way. I don't know, I know some people like, you know, obviously enjoy playing Lightning Blitz in the arena. I personally hate it. I feel like there's no, um, it's not a skill intensive matchup. It's just, let me press my Lightning Armor. <laughs> and hey, I have Rudal Warrior. You can't do anything about it. So that's just my preference. Um, I don't like seeing that type of um, stuff in the arena, but you know, everyone likes their own things. But yeah, back onto that point about the uh, immunity suppression. Like, we, we really don't have enough. Oh god. Um, do we even try? Like, I really don't know who this is. There's a few people this could be. But you know what? We're gonna find out. Oh, I can't. I, I don't like that bug. Where, you know, you just can't chat with people in the arena sometimes. Uh, I think this Kasama is pretty much dead. There's no way. No, there's just no way in hell he's not dead now. Oh, hey, they gave me the win. How nice of them. I really wanted to find out who that was, but, uh, oh well. Maybe we'll run into them again. Uh, oh yeah, so, yet again, returning to the point of that immunity suppression. Um, there are very simple ones that they can give us, but we are so slow on getting skill books that, um, I don't know, I don't think we're gonna get it anytime soon. But, um,. Was it Kinkaku? Yeah, Kinkaku. The gold one. Um, yeah, but Gin, I think, was silver. Yeah, so, yeah, Kinkaku. Kinkaku has one on the rope, so he does it twice. Um, his kin is not that great, I'll have to say that. But, that rope removing immunity is pretty good. And it, it does it mobile, too. So, it's a pretty good CC. Uh, he himself is not that great, but... We need more people with that ability to suppress immunity. I know there's not that many in the game, but... You know, we, we need some. Even the crappy ones, you know, help out. Hanzo obviously being one of the best ones on Chase. Um, and Mystery is obviously Kushina, and... I think... Yeah, Madara has it too, I think. The Ten Tails Madara has it, but... He's not readily accessible to everybody. So, yeah... Immunity suppression is going to be very important, especially if you want to um, handle units like Naruto. It, it's also a reason why you don't really see him in the Chinese servers, because for one, his damage, it, it's its multiple factors, but one of them is just simply the fact that he doesn't hit hard enough. It's, you know, in the Chinese servers, Kakuzu is just... <laughs> it's just not even to talk about it. just Kakuzu is just ridiculous and he does not even hold a candle to uh, Naruto doesn't even hold a candle to him it's just ridiculous um, people like to 
It's not that people like to, but people's argument is that Naruto's damage is so high that it kills your back row. But I don't really run into that scenario. Even when I fight people of my power level, my back row doesn't like instantly implode unless you know they're um, like placeholder who is a lot stronger. Than me. Um, okay, I'm gonna retreat. <laughs> Because they <laughs> they decided to put Madara on move three. Um, actually, maybe I could have fought that. Maybe I don't know. Maybe next time. <laughs> this I pretty conf. Well, I, I was pretty confident they were faster than me, so I shouldn't have wasted the sleep. I could have avoided that scenario. But, oh, yeah, back on that topic of uh, Naruto in the uh, uh, Chinese servers. He doesn't see as much play, simply for the fact that he doesn't scale. And scaling is very important in the damage. Actually, wait, no, I think I talked about that already. Oh, I was talking about my back row. Yes, my back row doesn't instantly implode to people who are, um, you know, stronger than me or, you know, about equal power. It's mainly because, as I said in one of my Crash Course videos, I s established a foundation for my, you know, weaker units. I know a lot of people don't want to do that and they were like, oh, you know, we gotta rush that move one, we gotta finish him ASAP. Technically, that is the right thing to do, in a way, but at the same time, by doing that, you neglect your back row and that's why you run into that scenario where that never do is going to like, implode your back row. Um, i shown it multiple times, my back row is not weak. Um, they're obviously not, sh you know, move one god status but their stats are still at least um enough that they don't instantly explode or implode against um a move one uh unless you know they're a lot stronger than me then you know there's nothing i can say about that uh but yeah like a super stacked move one with buffs like maybe like a hiruzen like a super stacked hiruzen <laughs> They're probably the only one who can um, blow up my move three and four. All right, can't keep messing up. This time we have to remember we have to throw the shark, and there we go. Oh damn! Um, I think he can get a cast off on me now. My Kareem? Why? No, my poison. Wait, what? Uh, he used his chaser on me, but that's what I reflected. Um. Okay, right, we're still gonna go after him. Yes. It'll speed up the process of killing him. Ow. Oh, that did not help. Maybe I shouldn't have cast this poison. I should probably have summoned the tree. Yeah. Bad plays all around on my side. So Watermain's gonna die here. But his back row should all die here with me. So let's see what happens. Alright. Let's drop that tree. Let's see, can these three take on him? I think there's a good chance they can, because he did get his resistance shredded a few times already. So, let's see. Uh, but, yeah, that wasn't that was not a good thing that, um, 
Kyrie need to hit my, um, whatchamacallit, you know, uh, still alive? Yes. Mm. Force dodge, yeah. tagging with sleep. So, this is going to be a close one. It really now is going to come down to does he have his mystery again? And he does. Uh, we're probably dead. It's a really close one. If only I had that immunity suppression. <laughs> he would have taken so much damage from that poison in the beginning. Oh well. Um... <laughs> Though I do find it funny that her um, debuff doesn't cause dodges to happen. Because um, you know how with Mane's uh, sexy jutsu, when she blinds them, she triggers their uh, dodge. Um, but her resistance shred doesn't. Um, I don't think any of the resistance shreds do, but I guess they don't dodge it because it's not really a status debuff. I guess, yeah, that probably is what the game mechanic is. It doesn't dodge unless it's like a status debuff that's like, you know, like cleansable in a sense. So, yeah, this journey is gonna take a while. Yes, I'm not playing the super serious team, and I'm seeing a lot of Naruto's in here. <laughs> and then the fights get dragged out. Yes. <laughs> Alright, I'll put you to sleep this time. Oh no! Actually, I don't remember, does the tree actually cleanse debuffs if it hits me? Or does it just heal? Ugh. So I can't use the tree to cleanse right now. Uh, think about this carefully, what we have to do. Okay, so... We have to... Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> a little more serious, I guess. Because this is just slowing me down. We'll make this a little more... Ooh, not this one. Where is she? Make this a little more serious. Uh, 
Hanzo was just really there <laughs> for the lols to see how much more poison I can do. Um, we'll bring actual healer here. Actually, in this scenario, I'm supposed to swap the two of them. Yeah, so that the tree spawns behind the main and then the slug spawns in front of Itachi. It's more ideal that way. It looks like it's really the same general people running around the arena right now. Um, and what was it? One was a Naruto. Well, two of them are Naruto's. One is a Edo Minato, and oh, it's four people because one is the Shisui Lightning main team. Did I run into anyone else? Uh, I don't think so. Actually, yeah, I don't think so. So yeah, it's just the same few of us trying to race to the top of the um, arena. I would thought that you know maybe there's some people still working on uh, uh, Shinobi Feast, the one you know where you have to do the arena runs. Maybe that there'll be people in here, but uh, I guess not. I guess everyone's either doing it on regular or they're just waiting for later to do the ranked one. Yeah, because we're not queuing into anyone right now. Um, kind of sucks. Still thinking about it, should I really have bought those Hanzo frags? <laughs> Probably not. Yeah, I think I think I'm right to not have not bought it, even though I really wanted to have that ability to have someone reliable like Hanzo suppress immunity. All right, we got a fight. The queues are getting a little longer now, but uh, this looks like someone new. Um, this is. Not someone very strong, so whatever. Um, so in this situation, I can't really nearly um, sleep people because. Like, what am I talking about? <laughs> uh, I, I was just thinking I can't really nearly sleep people because he has Kabuto, which gives him chakra. But then <laughs> I went and thought about it and was like, wait a minute, <laughs> he doesn't have any way to cleanse it, anyways. <laughs> Oh, I hate that sleep so much. Oh. Um, so, yeah. Bad setup there in the sense that um, if he didn't have the clone, that dog hit me and woke me up. Uh, you should always avoid doing that. You can avoid it really easily by um, shifting your fire mains over behind Kakashi so that the clone spawns behind Kakashi's clone and then the dog spawns somewhere else. <laughs> but this looks like a new player, so can't fault him too much. Uh, I also don't really understand what the team is attempting to do, so yeah. <laughs> but yeah, can't fault them much. Since, you know, they look relatively new to the game. But should kind of be avoiding ranked arena when you're kind of new to the game. Um, at least that's what I did. I didn't participate in ranked arena <laughs> like in the early ports of um, the game because <laughs> I know it was just not a place for me. Also, it's interesting that his, um, Orochimaru doesn't have books. Didn't we recently get his books? For free? 
Or oh, actually, no. Um, I forgot. You can't book them unless they're level four, um, they're four star and up. So maybe that's what happened. But yeah, um, this team here it has conflicting interests because you can't revive people with Kabuto's Edo Tensei after you use uh, Orochimaru's on him because Orochimaru removes them from the field. Uh, they don't work together, <laughs> and yeah, you should not use them together. Also, I feel like the, the Konoha Trader Orochimaru, his books are like meh because the only thing it does is like, oh, if when Toby Rama gets summoned, he'll instantly do his um I think, I think a mirror came out of it. Uh, but yeah, he instantly does the uh, water dragon. But it shows that the water dragon is not that strong. I, I don't know, it's just a thing for me. It's like, I feel like they could have buffed it or something? Did something with it. <sighs> I love that dodge so much. <laughs> Avoids so much CC. Alright, so there's a low... Um, okay. I. Uh, okay. I guess. <laughs> um. Sure. He's not mystering anytime soon. I don't need to do anything. <laughs> so. Yeah, I'll just wait you out. <laughs> Granted, though, I'm in mobile right now, so kind of sucks. Oh, she died. Um. Yeah, I don't know what to say to that. Um, outside of, well, <laughs> this was a lot of RNG in their favor because not only was he able to uh, reflect the CC onto me uh, more than once, it, it was just like, wow, really? Your your mirror set that back at you know my name. Even though there's so many things, but whatever. Um, can't do much about those type of things. Yeah, we're, we're gonna lose this simply because... Um, RNG was 100% not in my favor. Uh, also, I just wanted to say, I don't, I don't... It's one of those things that just... Kinda annoys me. I don't know why people like to run that team. Like, why do you have a Madara there? He doesn't... Do anything! He's battery you for nothing! Oh, is this fight again? My god. Um... Yes. Alright. So, we might have to actually hold Itachi's sleep to sleep um, his Itachi. No, 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 no. I have slugs. Oh, 
Huh? Why is he not mystery? I don't understand. What's he waiting for? Oh, he's trying to kill as many slugs as possible? Is that what's happening? Alright, alright. It seems like I can't have fun and play Shark Bombs because everybody wants to play Naruto. So, I guess I have to go and be serious. Alright. Really didn't want to have to go and be serious, but... Uh, who's that last person I usually run? Uh, trying to remember. Oh, yeah, that's where I run. Oh, trying to remember the whole time. It's this one right here. Alright, alright. Gotta be serious. But yeah, I do have to admit that, uh, well, I, you know what, I'm not going to say that it's, no, I, I, I'm just thinking of how to word it properly right now. Like, I want to say it's unhealthy for the game, but it's really not. It's not that it's unhealthy that Naruto exists, because he's not as broken as everyone thinks he is. But, like, arguably, I would have said Edo Hiruzen was way more unhealthy, but that's not really true well, actually, no, Edo was kind of true, because there was nothing you really could do about it um, if you were definitely weaker. There was no countering that shit. You just ate that and died on round one. So, yeah, um, it's not really unhealthy. It's more of like, oh, that's annoying. Like, eh. But you get over it. You figure it out. But it's only a problem in the arena simply on the fact that I can't bring a team that, you know, counters everything. <laughs> there's, a, you know, it's, there's Naruto's, there's Lightning Blitz, there's, like, Joni Minato's. There's, like, a lot of things that you you can and you will run into. And, you know, you can't answer it all. And it just makes the arena climb annoying. And, personally, the thing I always have to watch out for is a Shisui because he's damn annoying in here. Uh, he's not great outside of the arena, but in the arena, he is Damn annoying. Um, I have no clue what that person is doing in the ranked arena, but sure. I, I accept that free win. Thank you.
I wasn't paying attention, and I don't think I... Alright, let me just do this real quick. Oh, let's put you under sleep. I wasn't paying attention if I made the Minato dodge or not, but seeing as he can't lower his CD right now, I really don't care. <laughs> it's amazing that she's not, um, combo. <laughs> Alright, let's take him out of commission. So yeah, Sakura's relatively, um... This one here specifically is really, really good in the arena because these slugs <laughs> are even more tanky because your damage is so low in here that it's near impossible to kill these slugs. And it's pretty funny. Alright, we just put him to sleep now. And this fight more or less is over. Um, I did kind of forget to... Change my chase. I did the wrong chase for what I mean. It's supposed to be the knockdowns are high. So that's how you get the multiple CCs out of them. Alright, let's just kill them. Dodge teams are very annoying to me too, like, I just get annoyed when I see them, it's just like, ugh. But, they all have the same general weakness, they're really squishy, so... After you force a dodge out of them, they don't really do much. But yeah, like I, like I was saying, this model right here doesn't do anything in this team. You're not doing anything with this excess chakra. This this mystery costs 20. This mystery costs zero. Your main costs zero. And Madara costs 60. He's not doing anything here. The only thing he's doing is providing you a buff. And And I guess, yeah, in the arena buffs matter, but. I don't know, I don't feel like it matters enough that I'm going to put a whole slot there for a unit whose only purpose is really to give you a buff. Like, just better things that could be. But, yeah, that's one of those, hey, just me type of scenarios. Actually, thinking about it, his chase doesn't make sense either. He used Gamma Ken. I remember seeing Gamma Ken come out. So, yeah, with Gamma Ken, that doesn't make sense. Gamma Ken does a uh, blue post to knockdown, but when Minato does his chase, Masked Man is going to chase it to low float. Oh, unless his his chase was low to repulse. Then I guess that makes sense? Um, I also probably should have took Poison. I'm taking really long to kill people. But it also doesn't help that um, it's a bunch of dodge people, and um, yeah, I probably should just have poison them. Yeah, poison should just speed the process up. Alright, so some quick edits. So instead of safety, we'll go for poison, and this is this. We'll keep the healing tips.
Um... Interesting? <laughs> I think that's the only word I can use. Uh, I... Okay, what is this? Um, okay. Sure, what he's waiting on. Yeah, there's. I have a mirror too, so that wasn't going to work on me. I don't know. I don't know why this fire maid is up here. It would probably make more sense if that was Iruka, but. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the fireman was doing up there. I thought he was a DPS at first, like he was gonna like do the fireball jutsu and stuff, and it's like, no. <laughs> Though I do have to admit that was um, a lot of damage coming out of him. Whoops. Um, because uh, he has the buff from Shisui. He had uh, Iruka. And then, you know, the Itachi attacking twice. There's a potential that he took that Red Lotus buff, too, so he was hitting relatively hard. Uh, what is this? Um... Okay. I don't really have any witty commentary here. I will have to say he does hurt, though. Alright, let's just... Let's just avoid taking excess damage for no reason. So, he has to dodge again next turn. So, the only person we can actually hit here is Lightning Me. So, his team actually could work in the sense that um, if I wasn't holding two healers of healing tips, he would have probably killed my unit. But because I am using two healers with like uh, with healing tips, it's relatively hard for him to actually uh, kill me. Issue being that, you know, there's no scale. Like yeah you you you're hitting hard but you're hitting hard because you know you're expending buffs and stuff to do it. But your buffs are coming from, like, mediocre units. So, yeah, it's one of those. It, it looks good when you first initially do it. Is it Ariakage? Yeah, Ariakage. Um, but it's one of those... Uh, it could be something else and it could be better. Like, that Mangetsu, he wasn't really doing anything. He just gave you that dodge and it was just like... Okay. <laughs> uh, do you do you do anything else? <laughs> it's like no. Okay, you gave Chojiro another attack. Okay, <laughs> it could have just been um, like you know, Killer B, who's buff last two turns. <laughs> it's just like okay. <laughs> I feel like Mangetsu here is just not that good, and I also always forget that he's not a swordsman. <laughs> In the game, he's just like oh. You're not a swordsman. I forgot about that completely. So he doesn't get the root buff. Um, and it's just like, it's just weird. In the sense that, like, we all know he's a swordsman. Alright, alright, alright. Let's put you to sleep. Um, okay. I'll let you miss your first. Yo, 
So I can heal now. Oh wait. Oh my bad. I forgot Madara's here. Uh I'm so bad. That was my bad. <laughs> that was my bad. I I should not have let him go first. <laughs> but actually there was no real way for me to stop him. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Um Probably was doing better with the other team. Yeah, we'll just go back to playing that one. This team is like boring and slow, and that's why I don't like playing it. It does counter him outside of the arena, but eh. It's boring and slow. And I really don't like to play boring and slow teams. Um, who's the units? We'll touch it back up. Alright. This time. Oh, actually. Would that work? Huh. Let me try that. <laughs> I just thought of something. I'm I'm just gonna try it real quick. Actually, no. You should still be here. Uh no, this has to be the frog. This obviously has to be a shark. Uh, we don't need the heal. Okay, let's try this real quick. I'm only trying this real quick because um, we ran into that issue where uh, you know he was CCing me, but if a tsunade, I could put that buff on myself. Actually, no, my tsunade doesn't even have that equipped. But whatever. Uh, we'll still try it. Um, because we run that general scenario where the fight gets to the point where it's like water, water main dies and it's the three of them versus the Naruto. I want to see if I pull off that lightning armor <laughs> with Tsunade, can she take down that Naruto? Uh, I just want to see it. Um, we'll find out. But yeah, he more or less figured out how to beat this team already. He just needs to CC the... He, he needs to wait till the people are done healing and then, you know, tag my main with the chaos. Actually, if I really wanted to prevent it, I would do it like that. Yeah. The setup will look like that, so that Madara can never... Um, Burn my um, mirror on the chase. Yeah, because Madara or Naruto won't be able to do it either because, you know, they're going to hit Itachi. And Itachi is supposed to dodge it with a high probability so that their CC, I mean, their debuff doesn't get my mirror used. Yeah, let's just try it like this. Because mainly the reason why the CC was working was because he was burning my mirror. Um, I don't know what to say about this. Team. I don't know what this Minato is doing here. Outside of being like a chase pony. Like, he looks like he's just here to chase. But hey, I, I could absolutely be wrong. Oh, it's also nice that she does that too. <laughs> and she scales. That's why I, I love using the Tsunade. She was almost like auto add um, into most of my Water Chaos teams. Simply on the grounds that her. Um, she scales. And she heals multiple times in a turn. 
it's really good. And then, you know, if you switch it to her Y skill, she is able to give you a um, immunity to debuffs for two turns. And, you know, like I said, she's hyper-aggressive, which, <laughs> which I do love about her. And it's a free unit, you know? Everybody can get her. You get, like, free 80 frags of her through um, the Elite Instance, and then, you know, I think she, yeah, she has, like, two instances you can farm her in. It's really easy to get her to five stars and then, you know, get her books. All right, let's see what happens here. We know what our play is. We're sleeping him. Haha! <laughs> Worked it exactly like how I planned it to work. That actually looked like it hurt a lot, because that was 600 per hit, and she hit him three times. I think this moderator should be good as dead. Alright, we're gonna play it real safe now, because we're gonna have to make sure we can pull off this. So even if it degenerates to um, a long fight, Tsunade is going to be angry. Okay, we know he doesn't have Chakra, so he can't stop this. The only thing we're afraid of is if he chaoses her, because he'll not be scared. She'll be hitting us uh, multiple times. Oh, I wanted to see the lightning armor. <laughs> so, um, for people who are, you know, more free to play, the Tsunade here is a unit that you should be working on the side to get her books for. Because, you know, if you get all her books, you can swap in between her skills easily. And you... You definitely want to have her available. She's one of the, like, she's you know she doesn't cost you anything, and she is one of the um, best healers for free to play in my opinion. Like you know you don't have to go out of your way to invest in her because she's free, and she also can play the role of being hyper aggressive. Like in long fights, if you pull off that lightning armor, she attacks four times. No, three times. She attacks three times, heals two times around. And then she also gains damage each turn. Well, not each turn. Each time she crits you, she gains damage. Um, I have to admit, I wasn't paying attention. Uh, yeah, I wasn't paying attention. Alright, I'm just gonna go for it. Okay, it worked. <laughs> it's just like, uh, yeah, I, I really wasn't paying attention when I really should have been. Uh, she's probably gonna die because this Hitachi's gonna like pick out on her twice. Or that would happen. We're still fine, I think. We're still fine. He has nothing. He has nothing for a few rounds. Yes. <laughs> And we'll get really far with this poison. Yo, 
We just gotta make sure we kill the she slay. That's all. I really wouldn't mind if this tree healed me. <laughs> I know it could do it. <laughs> But, oh yeah, but we're yeah, talking about this Sinade, um, still, um, she is really, really good, can't stress that, um, people don't really pay attention to her because, you know, she's a free unit, but one of the best, uh, did he just change the setup? Is this him again? <laughs> Maybe I should, no, it wouldn't work because the heat is cleansing. Cause I'm thinking maybe I should sleep this Bodera so he can't combo me? Uh, no, I don't think that's what I need to do. Oh, there's a crit. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, chaos me. Oh, I, I keep forgetting to check, can this tree heal me? I mean, um, clear CCs on me. That was... Strange. How did my water main attacking myself cause a mirror to happen? That doesn't make sense, but... Whatever. Uh, that's not good. Cause we're on there like another round of chaos. Um, yeah. Okay. Next time we're gonna try chaosing this Madara and see what happens. Because he's the one who's eight, who's causing the chase to happen. The Earth Mean can't free him, from my understanding. Let me think about that. So he casts chaos. But he can't cast chaos. Yeah, he can't cast chaos until he wastes my mirror. He can't burn my mirror as long as Madara cannot attack. So, with that chain of thought, I should CC the Madara. Okay, got it. Yes, yes. And we said what two ranks ago? We have we have to get through Kage, then we hit Super Kage. Is there something else about that? No, right? Because after Super Kage, it's Sage, right? I think so. So bare minimum, we have like another twenty wins. No, no, it can't be twenty wins. Something around that. Oh God. But once we get this out of the way, we will not have to see it for another month. Maybe I should do a video on that. <laughs> uh, Sani and Tsunade. Um, not the young one, this one, the Sani one. Um, using lightning armor and fighting people. The only issue is that her lightning armor thing, it's on round three and the cooldown on it is 9 rounds. So, if you miss the opening, you'll never get it again. Unless you know your wind main. Wind main can help, but yeah. Oh, uh, I've got to fight. Uh... Okay, I'm relatively sure we're chaosing. This with me here. Oh wait, I forgot to mirror. I am being dumb right now. But whatever. She doesn't have her um She doesn't have her uh flower bird anymore. So we can actually see here. Yay, a crit! Okay. I as usual, he clones. So Actually, no, it's close gonna die. Okay, good. Um, can't miss on this Minato now. 
Yes. word, my froggy. Excellent. And then she got chaos too, so she can't do her flower guard. I mean, up uh, against impetus to help. Excellent. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before, let's see. Tree, 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 tree. Where's the tree? Uh, standard attack your chance says, wait, summon a Christmas tree standard attack that has a chance to heal three units with the lowest health and removing all debuffs. Okay, so it can remove debuffs. I have not seen it happen yet. How many fights have we been through with this tree? I have not seen this stupid tree heal me. <laughs> Maybe heal me once? Alright. Let's enact our plan and see does this work. Oh. Yes? I guess it will not work. <laughs> we just... We just got the... Uh, whatchamacallit, we got the control fail. Maybe this tree will heal me! Maybe! <laughs> oh, so bad. Ooh. That'd be crits. Oh, also, I just want to point out, she has actually one of the... She has one of the, actually, the uh, highest scaling. You know what, if it's the last one, I'm just going to retreat. We'll see what's up sometime. Uh, but yeah, uh, Sonaria here actually has some of the highest scaling there is. Because each time she crits, uh, she upgrades her own crit percent. And her... Uh, she upgrades her crit damage by 100%. I don't know what her crit percent goes up by. So yeah, her crit percent goes up by 30% each time she crits, and her crit damage goes up by 100% each time she crits. So, it's like a snowball effect. Once she starts going, almost all her hits will be a crit. And then her damage just keeps going up and up and up and up. Think of her like the Hulk. <laughs> and, you know, because she has this lightning armor thing, after she starts rolling, it just becomes ridiculous. It, it's why I really like her as a unit. But, you know, you don't really get to see much of her. Alright, so yeah, he's done. So we don't have to run into him. Uh, that might increase my queue time, though. Because, one less opponent. Um, we still have, what? Two... Four. And I think one each of those, so... Bare minimum twelve? wins, I believe? Uh, okay, so we ran into someone else. Um, Alright, because we, we're gonna lose our chakra anyways. We have to tag them. Uh, Tsunami got my back. Poison. Yeah, Tsunade. <laughs> uh, that's another thing I, I I forgot to point out. Her heal, she heals four people, and she cancels one layer of debuffs. Unlike all the other healers who do two people, but she heals not that much. She actually doesn't heal much. She heals like a little bit only. Because her ninjutsu stat is like abysmal. <laughs> I think it's like three digits. It's like 900 her growth. And then her attack growth is like 14 or some shit. It was really high her attack growth. But her um, heal. Uh, but her ninjutsu is really low. So you don't really use her as a healer in a sense. That's why I said she's like an aggro healer. Alright. This time we're going to be a little smart about it. Hey we're going to burn <laughs> We're gonna actually burn the mirror before we do anything. Oh, my mistake. I just realized. I can't burn his mirror. All his units are immune. Oh, shoot. That's not good. Uh, he probably should not have did that. 
I kind of just like dazed myself, even though I I, I openly just said <laughs> I can't do that to him because he had he's immune, and I still burnt my mirror. Um, yeah, that was just so bad of me. I don't know what to say about that. I have no excuse for that because I just literally just said it. Got Tsunade out of it. Oh wait, I still can't remove it because I had to heal Tsunade. Damn it! Itachi, you and your OP ass sleep. Alright, I'm just gonna retreat. That was my bad. That was 100% my bad. I literally said it out loud that... I can't sleep him like that because, I, uh, and I burned my mirror too. It's like, uh, yeah. It happens, guys. I just don't pay attention. <laughs> Actually, that's not even really paying attention. That was just a complete lapse of judgment. I just, I don't know. I, I don't know what was going through my head. All right. So the next time we encounter them. We absolutely have to tag them with the sleep right away. Or else... Uh... What is this? Oh crap, I just lost all my chakra. To Hashira. I don't think this is the same mod we ran into in the beginning, is it? Because that one was in a Christmas outfit. This one is not. I don't think it's the same one. We can fight him. I don't see a reason why we can. was really hoping that mirror bounced um, that CC back at Hashirama. Nah, we're, we're dead. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're just so dead. They're faster than me for one, and then for two, they're using really strong units. Well, actually, I won't say they're really strong units. It's just really that he's faster than me and I also didn't tag them with a sleep right away I I should have tagged them if I tagged if I tagged Hashirama with sleep I would have ate the Madara damage and then got out of it ideally get out of it alive with Chakra and then not use the shark bomb because I know Minato's one's coming up so I would catch Minato out and then that turn Madara can't use his attack yeah that yeah that that was the play I was supposed to sleep the Edo Hashirama the fire me cannot cleanse it water me would still be alive I would stop chakra yeah it would have made a big difference mm -hmm. but hindsight is always 2020 so yeah we generally know what we need to do though if we run into them again But well, that's two Madaros I saw today already, and both are Fire Mean. Interesting. Unless they're taking... Are they? Actually, they might be actually be taking it. They might be taking the Red Lotus um, passive, so that if Madara actually kills somebody with his Mystery, he resets. But the thing is that Madara's Mystery doesn't hit that hard. It's really his Chase that hits hard. So... I don't know. Well, it does still buff him, though, so his chase is even harder, I guess, but, eh. But yeah, I guess it's the final days of getting moderate, so I guess everyone's getting him now. 
Uh, I personally am not getting him. He's not that important to me. Um, that price tag is just not cool. And yeah, he's not super amazing in my opinion. Might be a very unpopular opinion, but I don't see him being like, you know, super amazing. He's not God tier. He definitely is not God tier. So I, I'm not going to go spend on him. It's just like, why? <sighs> I don't, you know, have fun playing super expensive ninjas. I can play random fun ninjas and still have fun. Um, actually, give me a second. Let me just do that <laughs> real quick. I no longer have to make that very specific setup. So yeah, queue time looks like it's taking really long because we're at Kage already, and we already lost one potential opponent because they're done. Lucky them. Lucky you, Ashura, you're done. Um, I still have to run through this and get to Super Kage. It doesn't seem that there's a lot of people around today. Um, if I don't find people, like, you know, constantly, I might actually... Uh, call it and take, you know, a break from this because, you know, no one showing up, it kind of defeats the purpose of us sitting here waiting for them. And, you know, getting to Kage is not that bad. Um, I probably should be able to be a Super Kage already if I wasn't, you know, joking around half the time running bad teams. Though I do find it strange that Ashura made it to Super Kage, well, he made it to Six Path already, so he was running into people because, you know, there were points where I wasn't running into him, and there was a few times where I ran into him and I beat him, so, so he had to have been running into more people than I have because I ran into the same few people, so... And right now, there's no longer anyone showing up. The queue is about to be two minutes. If the queue hits like three minutes, I'll just call it quits because there's really no reason for us to sit through this. And maybe I'll just continue again on the weekend um, when maybe more people are around to do arena. Yeah, it looks like nobody's showing up. Either we scared everyone off, or there was just no one to begin with. It could have been a little bit of both, also. Yep, three minute queue. Alright guys, um, I'm just gonna call it for now. We didn't make it all the way to uh, Six Path. We only made it to Kage. Um, so, yeah. Uh, we'll continue this um, next time, probably in the weekend when I have time again. Um, but, yeah, that's it for now. Alright, guys, have fun.